So I could technically wander off wherever I want to at this point, but uh, I think I'm just gonna follow him to Riverwood. Grab some nice flowers this along the way. You should go to Solitude and join up with the Imperial Legion. We could really use someone like you. And if the rebels have themselves a dragon, General Talios is the only one who can stop them. Join the Imperial Legion. Yes, that's where you can choose to join either the Imperial Legion or the Stormcloaks. Which, funny enough, is another thing I'd never done before. I just did a bunch of side quests and guilds and stuff. I got pretty close with defeating the... or beating the main quest. I never actually beat it. Which is why I've decided with this run I'm going to See beat the main quest. Bleak Falls Barrow. When I was a boy, that place always used to give me nightmares. Draugr creeping down the mountain to climb through my window at night. That Admittingly, it is pretty Frankly, creepy. I still don't much like the look of it. Ah, oh, there's a stone right here. I can decide stuff here. Like Guardian stones. Stuff. Three of the thirteen ancient the mage stone, that Skyrim's the warrior stone, Go ahead, and thief stone. Because my last one, I was a Khajiit, I always usually go with the thief stone, but this time I'm going to be a mage. So that's what I'm going to do. Except my sign. Mage, eh? Well, to each his own. It's not for me to judge. I generally prefer you to be a warrior. Or at least he does. I always like them shooty bits. Listen, as far as I'm concerned, you've already earned your palm. But until we get that confirmed by General Tullius, just stay clear of other Imperial soldiers. Uh, salmon. You can get salmon row that way if I stand here. Those are actually not always easy to find. You can sell them for big money. <laughs> can I catch a salmon? That was the question. There they are. I can't click them. No. What a troll. That's... Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Go down the river. With the moose. <laughs> I guess I got trolled then. No salmon for me. No salmon row. Where'd my guy go? See, I think running, running, that would be an important control to know. ZL. Ah uh, yes, the elusive salmon. I didn't want to be caught today. There we go, first town, Riverwood. Where I could decide whatever I want. My stamina is low. It's because I was running. Hmm, chickadee. Hello, Sven. You were a follower once. His story is a bit of a tragedy. He tries to go after somebody he loves, There's wants to marry, but someone else is trying to get his gal. And then he could choose for him to be a follower, and he'll never get his gal anyway. Uncle Halvor, hello. Such tragedy. So where did that guy go? There you are. Are you on leave from New person. Alvar. What happened to you, boy? Are you in some kind of trouble? Keep your voice down. I'm fine, but we should go inside to talk. What's going on? And who's this? It's me. She's a friend. Saved my life, in fact. Come on, I'll explain everything, but we need to go inside. Okay, okay, come inside then. Sigrid will get you something to eat, and you can tell me all about it. A dragon! I saw a dragon! What? Dragon! I saw a dragon! What kind of voice is that?
River Moose. Secret. We have company. What? Why? Why? Why did all that stuff just decide to go? P <laughs> There's a poltergeist in this house. Come, you two must be hungry. Sit down, and I'll get you something to eat. Now then, boy, what's the big mystery? What are you doing here, looking like you lost an argument with a cave bear? I don't know where to stop. You know I was assigned to General Tullius' guard. We were stopped in Helgen when we were attacked by a dragon. A dragon? That's ridiculous. You aren't drunk, are you, boy? Yeah, you'll believe it when they start attacking the town. Not much more to tell. This dragon flew over and just wrecked the whole place. Mass confusion. I don't know if anyone else got out alive. I doubt I'd made it out myself if not for my friend here. I need to get back to Solitude and let them know what's happened. I thought you could help us out. Food, supplies, a place to stay. Of course. Any friend of Hadvar's is a friend of mine. I'm glad to help however I can. Like I said, I'm glad to help in any way I can. But I need your help. We need your help. We need your help. We. So I can take all these gifts. There's lots of food and stuff. That's pretty nice. Lock picks. Nice little start there for healing. Apples. Could give them to the horses and sell his silver. Most excellent. Definitely like those potions, those are always helpful. As are the lockpicks, even if you're not a thief. We don't need mead. Who needs mead? Plus, it makes you slower. It even says right there 25% slower for 20 seconds. It restores your stamina, though. I don't want to be slower, though. Everything else is kind of meh. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgraf in Whiterun to send whatever soldiers he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. Do have any supplies that I could take? How do I get to raid one from here? What can you tell me about the Jarl? Can I use your forge? What can you tell me about Riverwood? What do you think about the war? Cross the river and then head north. You'll see it just past the falls. When you get to White Run, just keep going up. When you get to the top of the hill, you're at Dragon's Reach, the Jarl's Palace. Dragon's Reach. Could also use a horse and stable too to get there. Like I said, I'm glad to help in any way I can. Jarl Balgraf. He rules White Run Hold. A good man, perhaps a bit overcautious, but these are dangerous times. So far, he's managed to stay out of the war. I'm afraid it can't last, though. Which side in the war does he favor? I don't think he likes either Ulfric or Ellis as much. Who can blame him? But I've no doubt he'll prove loyal to the Empire in the end. He's no traitor. You support the Empire, then? And who is Elsif? Of course. Skyrim has always been part of the Empire. That doesn't mean I support everything the Empire's been doing lately. But Nords have never been fair-weather friends. Ah, I forget you're new to Skyrim. Jarl Elisif, I should say. Although only because she was married to Jarl Torig when he was murdered. Ulfric murdered Torig, you know. Walked right into his palace in solitude and killed him. Shouted him to death. Shouted him to death. Stories. What a sentence. That's what started this whole war. The Empire couldn't ignore that. Once the Jarls start killing each other, we're back to the bad old days. Which is funny, because in this game you could literally shout to death. 
I see no harm in it. The grindstone will improve your weapons, if you've got the raw materials. Gerda's family first settled here as woodcutters a few generations ago. She and Hod run the mill. I make a decent living sharpening axes and fixing the sawmill. People are rightly stirred up about the damn Thalmor being allowed to roam around arresting people just for worshipping Talos. But was it worth tearing Skyrim apart and maybe destroying the Empire? No. Ulfric will have a lot to answer for in the end. Nords have always supported the Empire. And the Empire has always been good for Skyrim. Lots of questions to ask in the beginning here. Why are the Thalmor allowed to arrest people for worshipping Talos? It's from that treaty that ended the Great War, remember? When the remember. Empire was forced by the Thalmor to outlaw Talos worship. I mean, I know I this, but assuming <laughs> this new character knows. Everyone still had their little shrine to Talos. But then, Ulfric and his sons of Skyrim started agitating about it. Sure enough, the Emperor had to crack down. Dragging people off in the middle of the night. One of the main causes of this war, if you ask me. Take what you need, my friend. Within Hello, reason, of course. Did you really see a dragon? All right, then. Did it have big teeth? Oh, it had well, big teeth. I'd better get back to work. You two make yourselves at home. May the nope. Wait, run. So right now I have no money. I can't exactly use a horse and stable in if I wanted to. Granted, that silver he just gave me, I could sell it. Mm, excuse me. There's a lovely little shop over here. Of which I could sell his silver he just gave me. Nobody believes you. But I tell you, I saw a dragon. Did you hear? By sure. It's my boy Sven has the... My boy fancies that Camilla Valerius. She'll come Apparently, out. it's locked right now. How lovely. It's probably getting to the later part of the day inside this world. Probably why it's locked. Are you locked too? Nope. Yeah, let's go in here. Well, one of us has to do something. I said no. No adventures, no theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. We are done talking about this. Oh, <clears throat> a customer. A great way for a customer to walk in. Well, I don't know what you overheard, but the Riverwood Trader is still open. You'll... Oh, a bit of this and a bit of that. Sell. Sell stuff. Always good to sell things in the beginning of one of these type of games. They give you free items, then you sell them. Sell it all. Like, who needs that? Magicka, rege bleh. Magicka regenerates 50% faster. I should probably wear that. Since that's effectively what I'm trying to do. See six, seven. Those are better boots. Excellent. I can sell the boots I am wearing. I could just picture it now. Just take off the boots. Here you go. Nice and smelly, just for you. Uh, she's probably not going to be much of a shield person, so I'll sell that too. Sell that. Sell my foot wraps. Just sell everything. Sell that as well. Skeever tail. Lockpicks are always useful. Hmm. 
nine, ten. That one's a better axe. Do you sell spells? I think I have a few old spell books laying about. If you want more, you'll have to go to the college winter home. Yeah, show me your books, Lucas. Lucian, rather. reward increases my armor rating oh I could raise a zombie blast of cold I thought it's gonna be do doing much more damage than my uh, fire at the moment creatures and people up to level 6 will attack anything nearby for 30 seconds that's actually a pretty useful spell the clairvoyance one if I have a few more things I could sell here, like books. Oh, I do have sparks, that's cool. I might as well learn that. I'll keep that in mind. Damn thieves. As if things weren't bad enough. Let's learn sparks. There we go. Hey, the way you walk around at home is your own business. When you're at home. <laughs> the way I walk around my home is my own business. What a... These these lines. Oh, so angry. Prevent the... The ball rug from passing. Yes, I do need a, a mage's staff. I can actually get them if I go to the College of Winterhold. Like, you just started that quest line. Uh, <laughs> I could technically do both of them at the same time. It's actually very effective to do that if I wanted to be a mage. I think that's the only place you can get a staff anyway. Alright, what you got over here? Thing. It's an inn. They could get food, but that doesn't really matter right now. Grab that. It's good. It's a thistle. It's a weed. Exactly what I needed. Alright, let's look at our map here. World map. You can look at all the locations. Just tell me I could either go to uh, the Earl of the White Run or the College. Colleges in Windhelm. If I am not mistaken. Or no, what am I talking about? It's not the College of Windhelm, it's the College of Winterhold. Winter. Winter. So this is the part where I get to just uh, <laughs> walk on foot for a while, because I am poor and do not have money for going on the horses yet. Nice ambient music in the meantime. I suppose the cool thing though is I can go over here to magic and say, hey, you, Sparks, I want you to be in the L and the R. Dual wielding magic. Yes. Let's do some of that. Also, on that note, I should wear the robes. Sounds like there's a lot of birds nearby. It's a moose. It is moose. I'm scared because I saw him in the river earlier. Nice clear path, no enemies so far. Gotta jump over everything. They say rock climbing is the thing to do in this game. 
Who needs path when you can jump over the rocks? Yes. It's okay, a little damage won't hurt anybody, right? <laughs> there we go. My first location. And a farm to steal everything from. I could burn their crops. If I felt like being mean. Well, that's taken care of. No thanks to you. She's trying to make me join the werewolves. She's a werewolf. I know it. I can tell. Certainly not. But a true warrior would have relished the opportunity to take on a giant. That's why I'm here with my shield brothers. An outsider, eh? Never heard of the companions? Werewolves. In order of warriors, Not companions, we werewolves. And sisters in honor. And we show up to solve problems if the coin is good enough. Sounds like a waste of time. <laughs> in my other run I did werewolf. So maybe maybe I'll offend her. Well, nobody asked you. If you think you're better than we are, go talk to Codlack Whitemane. See what a warrior of true metal is like. Maybe I don't want to be a werewolf this time. I'm so sorry. Try not to set anything on fire, all right? What if I do want to set things on fire? Oh, I could steal a horse. <sighs> not worth stealing at this time. I'll talk to you though. Got the fleetest steeds in all of Skyrim. Good. I don't have enough money for your horse. I am so sorry, man. Close with the dragons about. Official business only. Official business only. Riverwood calls for the Earl's aid. I have new front I have news from the Helgen about the dragon attack. Will this change your mind? Stand aside or else. So I could either intimidate him, give him money, persuade him to make me go in, or just say, I need the Earl's aid. Let's try persuading him. Fine. But we'll be keeping an eye on you. Keeping an eye on me, huh? Well, he was easily persuaded, I see. That didn't take much. I have dragon news. I do have dragon news. Here, I can actually see it better. We'll pay whatever it takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. Let us see the Arl. Right over yonder. It is pretty, though. I went the wrong way. I was so distracted by the beautiful steps in the distance. Nice tree in the center. Whoop! <laughs> I always want to go in the water, apparently. Nope. 
Nope. Oh. My boots are wet again. These boots are not made for walking. Apparently, I keep slipping. They say Helgen got hit by a dragon. One of those horns caught here. Yes. Dragon's Weech discovered. Brigands I can handle. River me. Careful if you cross the Careful if I cross the river. <laughs> He's telling me after going in the river a million times. What did you have to do then? Nothing? What's Hello. the meaning of this interruption? Oh, Balgrat is not receiving visitors. I just think we need more information before we I have news from Helgen about the dragon attack. Well, that explains why the guards let you in. Come on then. The Jarl will want to speak to you personally. Look at so, this pose. What does he think he is? Just getting all noodling eyes. in his throne. What is that pose? <clears throat> I've had great views from the Imperials. They were trying to cut off my head. The dragon destroyed Helgen, and last I saw it was heading this way. Really? really? You're certainly forthright about your criminal past. But it's none of my concern who the Imperials want to execute. Especially now. What I want to know is what exactly happened at Helgen. Dragon destroyed Helgen and lost the sword was heading this way. Imperials are about to execute Ulfric Stormcloak and then the dragon attacked. I should have guessed Ulfric would be mixed up in this what do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls against the dragon? My lord. We should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If that Your dragon is lurking in the mountains... Provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not... I'll not stand idly by while the dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Irileth, send a detachment to Riverwood at once. Yes, my Jarl. If you'll excuse me, I'll return to my duties. That would be best. Well done. You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done White Run a service, and I won't forget it. Here, take this as a small token of my esteem. There is another thing you could do for me. Suitable for someone of your particular talents, perhaps. Come, let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors of dragons. Rumors of dragon. I do want to see the wizard. He has things that I can take useful, if you will. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostilities, like the rest of the great warriors. Ah. Take an enchanted weapon or piece of armor, then use the arcane enchant. Once you know an, of course, I have everything you need for sale. If you have, yeah, what do you got for sale? Incantations for those with the talent to guess. Books. Let's look at your books. Yeah, you got lots of good stuff here. You got the fast healing, which is also really good. I still don't have the coin for that though. Firebolt. Yeah, those will be very useful if I have the coin. I don't have the coin. You know, if you've got the aptitude, you should join the Mages College in Winterhold. So they keep telling me to join the Mages College. Go ahead and fill her in with all the details. So the Earl thinks you can be of use to me. Oh yes, he must be referring to my research into the dragons. Yes, I could use someone to fetch something for me. Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into a dangerous ruin in search of an ancient stone tablet that may or may not actually be there. He wants me to see an ancient stone tablet. <laughs> What's that to do with dragons? Ah. No mere brute mercenary, but a thinker. Perhaps even a scholar? You see, 
When the stories of dragons began to circulate, many dismissed them as mere fantasies, rumors, impossibilities. One sure mark of a fool is to dismiss anything that falls outside his experience as being impossible. But I began to search for information about dragons. Where had they gone all those years ago? And where were they coming from? Steal a staff from a wizard. I can. What do you I, need me uh, to do? I learned of a certain stone tablet said to be housed in Bleak Falls Barrow. A dragon, dragon stone. stone. Said, go to Bleak Falls Barrow, find this tablet, no doubt interred in the main chamber, and bring it to me. Bring it to him. Simplicity itself. Are you the only wizard in Right One? Where can I learn about magic? What are the duties of the court wizard? Do you have allegiance to the Imperials? Have you encountered any dragons? All the things. <laughs> I believe I am, yes. Technically speaking, of course. The city is also home to a priest, priestess, an alchemist, and I'm sure others who practice. Ah, that reminds me. Speaking of alchemists, I have some frost salts for Arcadia. She asked me to obtain them for one of her potions. Would you be Ooh, so kind as to deliver trying to get me on one of them side quests that don't matter. You'll provide some form of recompense. I know what that means. Ugh, always asking me to do errands. I mean, on the plus side, I'll get coin. I do kind of need coin right now. Fine, fine. You're clearly better suited than I am to carry out such a menial task. A prospective student, are you? Well, I'm afraid I'm not much good at teaching. You should try your luck at the College of Winterhold. Sadly, no. My work affords me few opportunities for such an adventure. Perhaps some hero will bring one to Dragon's Reach. Like, what a fascinating conversation that would be. Off to Bleak Falls Barrow with you. The Jarl is not a patient man. Neither am I, come to think of it. We need it quickly, before it's too late. Of course, what if I wanted to steal your stones? It's right there. Soul gems. They're I'm good. Sure she will prove most useful. Succeed at this, and you'll be rewarded. White Run will be in your debt. So I think with that said, I think this is a good halfway point right here to do some stretching and warm up my tea. So I'll be back momentarily. In the meantime, enjoy some nice music. Thank you. 